welcome to the 16th lecture of EDC. We are still in the first module basic semiconductor physics and it, this is the fifth lecture video for doping. Now in this video we are going to understand about the donor and acceptor level ionization. Well, as we know for N type semiconductor donor level will be nearer to the conduction band. For P type semiconductor acceptor level will be nearer to the valence band. This is your valence band. This is your conduction band for P type semiconductor. This is your valence band. This is your conduction band for N type semiconductor. Now there is couple of um, note points, beautiful, beautiful, important points. Let's start understanding those things. Moving on. First, first note point at 0k, the pentavalent impurities in N type. Look here carefully at 0k we are only looking at the n type okay we are only looking at the n type at 0 kelvin at 0 kelvin the pentavalent impurities of n type will be there on donor level now if you increase the temperature listen carefully if you increase the temperature from 0 kelvin and onwards your electrons or the uh, or we can say the pentavalent impurities which are present in on donor donor level they will start moving to the conduction band when when they will start moving to the conduction band if you increase the temperature from 0k to above now at 300k at 300k you at 0k they are all are available at the donor level if you increase from 0k to 300k, agar 0k ke 300k, this is the first case. This is the second case, okay? This is the first case. This is the second case. First case mein donor level mein electron honge. If you increase the temperature from 0k to 300k, the second case, they will start moving from donor level to the conduction band. The electrons start moving from donor level to the conduction band first thing second thing kya hota hai? along with within this 0k and 300k along with the movement of electron from donor level to conduction band along with the movement of electron from donor level to the conduction band the shifting of donor level also happens within this 0k to 300k two things happens in 0k to 300k first thing what electrons starts moving uh, from donor level to the conduction band and second thing what happens is the level this level this level start start shifting this entire level I'll show you this entire level this uh, the level was here okay so within the 0k to 300k aapka uh, electron to move karta hi rahega uske aapka energy level this donor energy level also start shifting to the conduction band same thing happens same thing happens same thing happens in case of acceptor level there will be availability of holes on this acceptor level okay uh, if you increase the temperature from 0k to 300k the holes start shifting from this acceptor level to to the valence band along with that the acceptor level also start shifting from this point to the valency band aapka holes move karenge along with that your acceptor level also start shifting into the valency band into the valency band but at 0k sare electrons all the free electrons are available on donor level donor level ye yahan pe yahan pe conduction band mein aapka koi bhi electrons nahi rehta n type extrinsic semiconductor n type ho ya p type ho at 0 kelvin na ki aapke conduction band mein koi electron available hota hai ke valence band mein na hi koi holes available hote hain p type mein n type mein at 0 k mein na hi koi electron available hote hain conduction band mein p type mein 0 kelvin mein na hi koi holes available hote hain valence band mein so if you increase the start increasing the temperature all of these materials start moving from their donor level or acceptor level to the valence band or to the conduction band. Now, the movement of charge carrier from donor level to conduction band 
and acceptor level to the valence band this movement is called donor level ionization in case of electron and in case of hole it is called acceptor level ionization so what we can say in donor level ionization in 0k to 300k in n type semiconductor electron start shifting from donor level to the conduction band and this is called donor level ionization and due to this donor level ionization your donor level start shifting towards conduction band okay now listen to this carefully for acceptor level if you increase the temperature from 0 kelvin onwards all the holes present at the acceptor level they start shifting from this level to the valence band this is called as acceptor level ionization holes ko movement hona acceptor level se valence band ko that is called as acceptor level ionization and due to this acceptor level ionization your acceptor level start shifting from its initial position to the valence band theek hai all these points jo bhi maine aapko bola wo sare cheez main yahan pe likh rakha hai ठीक है अभी सारे पॉइंट्स को जल्दी जल्दी पढ़ लेते हैं एट जीरो के द पिंटा वैलेंट इम्प्योरिटीज इन एन टाइप दैट मीन्स द इन इलेक्ट्रॉन्स ओके एट डोनर लेवल डोनर लेवल पे होते हैं जीरो के एट जीरो के द ट्राई वैलेंट इम्प्योरिटीज इन पी टाइप एट एक्सेप्टर लेवल ओके सो इफ यू इंक्रीज द टेम्परेचर फ्रॉम जीरो के ऑनवर्ड्स द पिंटा वैलेंट इम्प्योरिटी एट डोनर लेवल और मूव moves to conduction band similarly if you increase the temperature if you increase the temperature okay the trivalent impurities at acceptor level moves to valence band now this movement of charge carriers to conduction band and valence band is called for 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 pentavalent impurities a donor level moves to conduction band this is called as donor level ionization and for trivalent impurities at acceptor level when it moves to valence band it is called at acceptor level ionization just go through these slides you can understand this thing i think you got this point okay so if you increase the temperature from 0k onwards impurities moves up donor level shift upward due to the movement of this impurity that is called donor level ionization and due to that donor level ionization donor level shifts upward and if you increase the temperature from 0k impurity moves down that means holes moves down that means your acceptor level ionization happens and due to that acceptor level ionization your acceptor level moves down ye jo aapka acceptor level hai ye acceptor level hai wo moves down hota hai simple okay simply aap is cheez ko अंडरस्टैंड करो मूवमेंट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड मूवमेंट ऑफ होल इज हैपनिंग करेक्ट इन द फर्स्ट केस to valence band okay so if you increase the temperature look carefully very in case of n type semiconductor pehle movement of electrons hota hai from donor level to conduction band then donor level shift to uh, conduction band okay here this is called the movement of the movement of electron from donor level to conduction band this stage is called donor level ionization from movement of holes from acceptor level to valence band this stage is called this stage is called aapko main yahan se tir lagao to sahi lagega look here this stage is called aapka donor level ionization pehla jo stage hai aapka usi stage ko bolte hain donor level ionization or in case of acceptor or holes it is called as acceptor level ionization 
ये गॉड दिस पॉइंट दिस इज़ अ वेरी सिंपल पॉइंट उसी चीज़ को हम यहीं पे लिखा है मैंने अच्छे से इन केस ऑफ यू टेम्परेचर इनके फ्रॉम जीरो के टू थ्री हंड्रेड के डोनर लेवल एनाइजेशन हैपन्स इन द फर्स्ट केस वेरी फर्स्ट केस फिर उसके बाद डोनर लेवल शिफ्ट टू कंडक्शन बैंड यहाँ पर भी वैसे ही हुआ है पहले एक्सेप्टर लेवल एनाइजेशन होते हैं देन आपका एक्सेप्टर लेवल शिफ्ट टू वैलेंस बैंड होता है पहले आपका एक्सेप्टर लेवल आइनाइजेशन हुआ फिर आपका एक्सेप्टर लेवल शिफ्ट टू वैलेंस बैंड किसको बोलते हैं एक्सेप्टर लेवल आइनाइजेशन मोमेंट ऑफ हेयर होल्स फ्रॉम एक्सेप्टर लेवल टू वैलेंस बैंड ओके सो वेरी सिंपल पॉइंट नाउ एट थ्री हंड्रेड के होता क्या है एट थ्री हंड्रेड के टेम्परेचर एट थ्री हंड्रेड के दैट इज एट अ रूम टेम्परेचर और फ्री इलेक्ट्रॉन इन केस ऑफ एन टाइप सेमी कंडक्टर और फ्री इलेक्ट्रॉन अवेलेबल एट कंडक्शन बैंड एंड इन पी टाइप केस आर होल्स विल बी अवेलेबल अवेलेबल एट बैलेंस बैट फिर उसके बाद आप कंडक्शन कर सकते हो थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो नाउ दिस इज अ कॉन्सेप्ट विच इज़ वेरी 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 पावरफुल एंड वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट कॉन्सेप्ट आई वॉन्ट यू टू रिवाइज दिस कॉन्सेप्ट एज मेनी एज इट इज पॉसिबल एंड गो थ्रू दिस लाइट दैट आई हैव गिवेन यू ऑन दिस लेक्चर थैंक यू सो मच बाय